General Tatterland, how nice of you to respond so quickly to my call. It's hard to say no to one of your invitations, Skeletor. He was real happy to come here. <laughs> Let's get this straight. I didn't come because that walking can opener made me. I came because I heard that you had a plan to defeat He-Man. Such plans I find very interesting. I want to see that do good defeat defeated just as much as you do. Well then, I have just the plan for you. Trapjaw! Oh, yes, Master. Trapjaw, the General and I have important business to discuss. Oh, yes, Master. It has nothing to do with you. Oh, yes, Master. Trapjaw. Right here, Master. Get out of here! Right, Master, right. Not too bright, is he? As you can see, General, when I require intelligent assistance, I have to look somewhere besides Snake Mountain. That's why I called on you. You mean for my brains? That, and because you are heartless. When I said heartless, I meant just that. As you are a goblin, I understand you do not have a heart. That's true, we don't need them. Then you do not have a heart beat, right? Of course not, but I don't understand. Why do you ask these questions? I thought you had a plan to defeat He-Man. I do, but this time we're not going to defeat He-Man. We're not? No, this time He-Man is going to defeat himself. <laughs> <laughs> It doesn't look good, Your Majesty. Sensors report that Skeletor is building a huge structure on the other side of the planet. Exactly where is this structure, whatever it is located? On the Crystal Sea, Your Majesty, near the small village of Zack. I've been there before. A charming, peaceful little place. Skeletor is forcing all the villagers to work for him. Well, we'll have to put a stop to that. Still, the situation worries me. It's not like Skeletor to be so obvious in his actions. It's as though he wants us to investigate. But what reason could he have for that? Uh, I, I don't know. Duncan, why don't you fly out to Zack and take a look for yourself? Right away, Your Majesty. <laughs> dimensional gate but it's so huge uh, what's Skeletor up to now that right side doesn't seem safe to me the supports are weak this looks like trouble I'd better change by the power of gray skull <laughs> This push will cause it to collapse. Are you ready, Tataran? Let me test the force field. Is it working? Give it a try. Excellent. Turn it off for a minute. Now to change you into your disguise. How do I look? Perfect, perfect. Get ready now. Here comes He-Man. Skeletor, why are you forcing honest men and women to do your dirty work? You should be ashamed of yourself. Honest men do an honest day's work, or I destroy the village. Why, you... But your structure is not safe. Someone may be injured. That's your opinion, Tin Hat. Now go away. I have things to do. Well, if you want my opinion, this thing is almost as silly looking as Skeletor himself. Well, who asked you, you little vermin? That was a big mistake, Skeletor. Not as big as the mistake you're about to make, He-Man. can't read. 
reach me? That's what you think, Skeletor. If I can't go around, I'll come through. No! Skeletor. Demon! Help us! There's someone under here! Oh no. Stand aside. I must make my change. I, is he? There is no heartbeat. He's dead. He was my brother. You killed him, He Man. You killed him. He's your he man. He man. He you did it. We have to go after him. He needs to be alone for a while, Orko. We better go back to the palace and report. You go. He man needs me. It was an accident, He man, an accident. You can't blame yourself. The thing wasn't safe. It fell apart. It doesn't matter, Orko. The point is, I acted without thinking. And a man died. But, but He man. Orko, when I first became He-Man, I swore to uphold that which was right and to protect the innocent. Accident or not, today I broke that promise. But... I'll be fine, Orko. Now run along. There's something I have to do. I hope you'll be okay. Oh my gosh, I better hurry back or Man in Arms will take off without me. Everyone's gone, Tataran. You can get up now. He-Man was completely fooled. I'll say. He really believes I'm dead here. Yes, I doubt if He-Man will give us any more trouble. Now, we can rebuild that gate, and this time for real. A trick! It was all a trick! What? A spy! I'll take care of him. <laughs> <laughs> Today I broke a promise and proved myself unworthy of the great power that was given me. And if I am unworthy, I can no longer permit myself to be He-Man. Let the power... Return! I brought the Wind Raider, Adam. Let's go home.